In this field, two different types of peas are grown. One type only has round seeds, and the other type has wrinkled seeds. Mendel ensured that the parental plants were purebred by allowing each variety to self-pollinate for two years. In order to cross these breeds, first we have to plant the seeds and wait for them to grow. These plants are the parental or pea generation. Their buds are cross-pollinated. The pollen from one type is placed on the stigma of the other. Here, the parental generation, P1, is already bearing fruit. Its seeds are the first filio generation, or F1. Even though they originate from one parent plant with round seeds and one parent plant with wrinkled seeds, all of the seeds are round. This diagram shows the same thing. If we cross-pollinate two pea plants with different traits for a specific characteristic, the hybrid offspring are all the same in the dominant characteristic. The characteristics of living things are controlled by hereditary units called genes. Genes for the same characteristic called alleles occur in pairs. In the sex cells, however, only one of each allele is present. This is the law of segregation. The allele for round is here called capital R, and the allele for wrinkled is small r. The parental generation P1 is purebred. This means that both its alleles are identical. The sex cell, or gamete, contains each allele only once. During fertilization, the gametes fuse into one another. The seeds from the F1 generation contain two different alleles. They are crossbred. Their appearance, however, is round. The two alleles have a different influence on the appearance. The allele, capital R, determines the shape of the seed. It is dominant. The allele, small r, is not distinct. It is recessive. So all of the peas in the F1 generation are round.